Hello my friends, in this video I will show you how to run a program in Windows 95 inside Windows 10. First, you need to have your program, the program you want to run in Windows uh, 95, okay? And also, you will need some other programs to, to run the, this program, okay? You will need uh, a, a program called Ultra ISO, okay? And also you need a program called DOSBox. I will let in the description the links where you can download Ultra ISO here and where I'm passing the mouse here down the bottom right. Okay. And the it's a cute, this is the Ultra ISO program. Okay. And you also will need a program called DOSBox, which I will let in the description. Okay. Inside Ultra ISO. Here's inside Ultra ISO, okay? Uh, if you want to download Ultra ISO, I will let the, the website in the description. They have a free trio, okay? So you can use it for free for a number of days, which is good for you. And also, I will let in the description the download of DOSBox, which is simple, free and easy to download, okay? You're gonna install these two programs. It's essential to to run your program in Windows 95. Okay, I will let in the description the image file. You also will need uh, the image file for Windows 95. So I I will let the the image file of Windows in the description too. So you need three things: the Ultra ISO, the DOS box, and the Windows 95 image. You also will need a code which I will let in the description also, okay? To mount the Windows 95 into, into your Windows 10 or Windows 11, okay? And you, you will need basically these three things, Ultra ISO, DOSBox, image of Windows, and you gotta save this code, okay? To type. Uh, you will need to create a file on your C drive called CN, okay? A folder called CN on your C drive. And you're gonna open Ultra ISO, okay? You're gonna open the CN and put the the Windows image there inside the CN, okay? So you're gonna click two times with in the ISO image, okay? And in the top you will see the image file, okay? You're gonna click on Program Files. In the Program Files you're gonna create a new folder, okay? New in this new folder you're gonna call CN. Okay, CN, and you click two times. You're gonna find in the bottom here of Ultra ISO the the file you want to run in Windows 95, which uh, is this file setup.exe. Okay, and you're gonna transfer to this folder to this folder CN inside the Windows Image ISO. Okay, okay, Windows Image, and you you transfer now to the C program. CN, a folder CN, the file you want to run in Windows 95, inside the Windows 95 image, okay? After that, you're gonna click on save, okay? You're gonna click on the, on the save in the Ultra ISO, okay? Here in the, the save button, in the Ultra ISO. Now you saved the, the program, okay? In the folder CN, the file, the, the, the program you want to run in Windows 95 image. So, you already inserted your program inside Windows 95 image. It's all right now. Now you're gonna run the the DOS box. Okay, you're gonna run here the DOS box. You're gonna double click on the DOS box. Okay, and you're gonna you're gonna appear this window, this blue window. It's the window we want to work. Okay. In this window, you're gonna type this code. Okay which you previously put the Windows 95 image in the C uh, folder CN, okay? C, and you create a folder CN and put the Windows 95 image inside the folder CN, okay? And you double click and you see the Windows 95 image inside the folder CN, okay? Now in the DOS box, you're gonna type the, the code okay you're gonna type first mount okay mount space c 
space C folder CN, okay? So you're gonna type here inside those box, okay? You're gonna space C, space C, C folder CN, okay? And you give enter, okay? The drive says mounted, okay? Now you're gonna type C two points, okay, to go to the the C folder inside the DOS box, okay? So you're gonna type C and give enter, okay? Now you are on the on the C hard drive inside the DOS box. You're gonna type dir di d i r, okay? And you see the Windows image there, okay? Inside your drive C on into your DOS box, okay? Now you're gonna mount the Windows 95 image. You're gonna type EMG mount, okay? E the exact way it's written here on the on the video, okay? You gotta be exact with same letters on the same size of all letters, okay? It's important, okay? So you're gonna type EMG mount space A space C W95 point EMG, okay? And you press enter, okay? The drive A is mounted as C, e, the Windows image there, okay? Now you're gonna type boot C double double 95.EIMG, okay? Boot double 95.IMG. And you're gonna uh, press enter, okay, you're gonna press enter and now it's starting Windows 95, okay? It's starting Windows 95, if it takes too long to, to run the Windows 95, you press enter and you enter on the scan disk, okay? Uh, if it gets too long to, to run the Windows 95, you press enter, okay? And you start the scan disk. So I'm gonna press enter, it's taking too much to load, okay, I'm gonna click on the program. and press enter, okay, we will appear this window and after this blue window, you are in Microsoft ScanDisk you type exit, X, which is the X letter so you're gonna run the Windows 95 again and it will run the program, the, 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 the Windows 95 now the Windows 95 is open, okay you're gonna click on my computer, okay here is the Windows 95 interface, okay? You're gonna click here. When you click in the in the DOS box, the mouse will only work inside the Windows 95. If you want to run the, the mouse without the Windows 95 in the Windows desk, you press Ctrl Alt Dell. Ctrl Alt Dell. So you you can regain access, access to Windows 10 mouse. But you need to click on the Windows 95 to Keep the mouse in the Windows 95, okay? So now you, you open the program files, you open the drive C, you open the, the program files here where I'm passing the mouse, and you will find the folder CN, which is the file we want to, to install. Now I will click, double click in the file I want to install, and I will extract the, 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 the files I want, okay? So I click next, next, okay? Next. And I I is extraction the files I want, okay? Now the, the files are ext extracted, okay? I close here, go in the my computer, go in C, program files, and you you will found the, the files I installed, the files are extracted, okay? Now the thing you're gonna do is control out the L and you're gonna leave the 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 Windows 95, okay? Now you we, you don't you won't close the DOS box. You open the Ultra ISO, okay? It's important. In the Ultra ISO, in the bottom, you're gonna type C and you go to the folder CN, okay? And you're gonna find the Windows image. In the Windows in the Windows image, you're gonna double click in the Windows 95 image, okay? Here is the 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 
the files, the, the folder I, I created the setup. Here's Windows 95 image. You're going to double click Windows 95 image, okay? In the Windows 95 image, you click on program files, okay? And you will see the folder created after the installation, okay? With all the files I want. Here's the, the, the program and here's the program that was extracted. And here is the, the files I really need. So I'm going to, with the right click, you're going to click on extract to, okay? And you find a select some folder I, I select from documents, okay? And I will extract these files for my Windows 10, for my computer. So now after it extracted, I can close all the programs, okay? And I can go to the documents, okay, where I, I where my files are. So here is my files that I I run and in the Windows 95 extracted and now sent to my Windows 10. So all the files are here, uh, and there is a success su success on the, my job, okay. So that's it, people. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it make easy for you to run programs in the Windows 95 and extract to your PC. So that's it. If you enjoy, please give a like. Thanks.